when I first got the job here, talked to the Mets about him. We had Suzuki and Flowers, so didn't have a clean fit. And then last year, when he was released by the Mets, we reached out to his agent in that short period of free agency, again, with McCann and Flowers, we didn't have a clean fit. We weren't surprised to see him do well with the Rays. He just needed to get back to playing. First off, I heard they treat their players' family like it's their own family. You know, I have a wonderful wife and a, and a daughter, and to be around this environment as she's growing up was huge for me. I heard the clubhouse environment is amazing here. You know, I'm gonna be spending more time with these guys and my wife and my daughter, so I, I gotta make sure I'm always in a good mood and always, you know, feeling good, and, and I think that translates into playing well. The upside with the bat is big. He's got tremendous power to all fields, especially the ball carries really well to right center, and he's got really good power there. Also, it's a championship caliber team. You know, there's no holes. Everybody plays well, and you can tell that they're always fighting until the last out, which I really like. And finally, Sal Fasano was a big reason I wanted to come. He was an old manager of mine, and um, I felt really, really great after that year, and I learned so much. So I just want to keep picking his brain and learn as much as I can. I just know he's a good person, you know. I know he wants to win. I've been lucky that all the catchers since I came back to Atlanta have been great to work with. He's another one. I've known him for years now. Um, so it's real easy. I mean, we're having a great time, all the catchers together with Sal. Teammate-wise, he's great. Guys like throwing to him. From a defensive standpoint, he's worked with Sal in the past. We think the framing and the receiving is good. We think it can get better. It was a lead at one time, and uh, we think we'll be able to get him back to that level. I want to get better defensively, and Sal's going to help me get there, and so is Tyler as well. He's such a brilliant guy and knows so much about this game and this staff. You know, three heads are definitely better than one. I know he's into the game and into the preparation, and. and kind of the things I think are important for, for catchers. I caught a lot of great arms in New York, but I, I also caught a lot of great arms in Tampa as well. And they were all young guys too. So I'm just gonna try to uh, come over here and, and spread as much knowledge as I have into them and, and learn what they like doing on the mound as well. And, and I've hear, heard nothing but great things about how these guys keep their demeanor really well. And, and I feel like we're gonna do great things. You know, my brother was here and he told me how much the fans loved him and treated him well. So, so I'm really looking forward to it. And, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun.